math and science. In this video, let's rewrite 875 as a fraction. So I'm going to start by putting 87.875 over 1. The next thing I need to do is move the decimal to the right three places so that the decimal, you no longer have a decimal. And I can do that by multiplying it by 1,000, okay? Because I'm moving it three places to the right. When you multiply 0 0.875 times 1,000, that equals 875 because it's 1, 2, moving it three places. And then 1 times 1,000 is 1,000. Now what I need to do is reduce the fraction or simplify. So I'm going to use a factor tree to find the greatest common factor. I can multiply 5 times 175, circle the 5, because that this is prime, and then 5 times 35 equals 175, and then 5 times 7 equals 35. I'm down to prime numbers, so I'm finished. 1,000, 2 times 500 equals 1,000, circle the 2. Now I can go 2 times 250 equals 500, circle the 2, because it is prime. And let's try 2 times 125 equals 250. And then I can go 5 times 25 equals 125, and 5 times 5. A lot of 5s here. Now what I can do to stay organized is I can write, create a little chart, and remember I'm still working on getting the uh, greatest common factor, rewrite the prime numbers. For 875, I have 5, 5, 5, and 7. And for 1,000, I have, uh, I'm going to start with the 5s, 5, 5, 5, and then 3 2s. I'm going to skip the 7. Okay. So now to find the greatest common factor, you look for vertical pairs, since I'm working on, so vertical pair. So here's a vertical pair, here's a vertical pair, vertical pair, no, 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 and no. So now I just multiply 5 times 5 times 5, and that equals 125. So now I go back to my original thing, 875 divided by 125, and 1,000 divided by 125, and that equals 875 divided by 125 um, equals 7, and then 125 goes into 1,000 eight times. The nice thing is when you get to this point, you can just use a calculator and put 875 divided by 125 equals 7, and the same with this. So there we go. 0.875 as a fraction. It took a little bit, but it is 7 eighths. Thanks for watching, and Moomoo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.